It is often possible to wait until all the permanent teeth have erupted to begin orthodontic treatment. However, in many cases, this delay will make treatment more difficult or may even compromise the final result. In these circumstances, two-phase orthodontic treatment is utilized to obtain the best result. To take greater advantage of growth, a first phase of treatment is carried out at a younger age, when baby teeth are still present. During this initial phase, growth modification procedures are attempted to correct the more difficult structural and functional problems. However, since the permanent teeth have yet to erupt, the final result cannot be produced. The second part of this two-phase treatment is performed later, when all of the permanent teeth have erupted, to produce the final result. Let's take a look at one example of a two-phase orthodontic treatment, where the upper jaw has not grown sufficiently in width. This underdevelopment of the upper jaw has resulted in a structural problem with the lower jaw, known as crossbite, and insufficient space for the upper lateral incisors to erupt. To correct this underdevelopment, the first phase of treatment involves growth modification procedures to promote the widening of the upper jaw and correction of the crossbite. This phase one treatment or early growth modification makes the total treatment easier, the teeth more stable, and often eliminates the need for permanent tooth removal. However, at the completion of this phase one treatment, baby teeth are still present. The first phase in no way ensures the permanent teeth will later erupt into the proper alignment. The remaining permanent teeth usually erupt out of alignment and do not mesh together properly. With all of the permanent teeth in place, the second phase is possible. During the second phase of treatment, full braces consisting of bands, brackets, and arch wires are placed. With control of all the permanent teeth, it is now possible to correct all individual tooth positions and produce the final result. Remember, two separate phases of treatment were necessary to produce this beautiful result. Phase one, early treatment for growth modification before all of the permanent teeth have erupted. This was an example of a case with an underdeveloped upper jaw. However, there are many other growth problems requiring an early first phase. Phase two, or final phase, after all of the permanent teeth are present for final tooth alignment.